What's up guys, my name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot and today I've got a video for you on downloading and installing Valorant if you're lucky enough to get a Twitch drop. Now unfortunately it took me up until now to not get a drop and instead get an account off of a friend who managed to get two drops. Either way, today I'll show you how you can download and install the Valorant beta and go ahead and play it. So first of all, head across to the link down in the description below and if you see this over here saying sorry page not found, then you're simply not in the right region. Make sure that you're either in the US or EU, and if you're not in those places, make sure to go ahead and connect to a VPN in one of those areas, so you can go ahead and sign in to start your download. I'm pretty sure you can finish your download without your VPN on. Either way, I'm going to go ahead and use a VPN to connect to somewhere in Europe. And once you're connected to somewhere in the EU, hold down Control and hit F5 to clean refresh the page, clearing your cache, and you should see something that looks a little bit different. Then simply click the download button over here and you'll be downloading the installer. Then once the download is complete, you can go ahead and disconnect from your VPN if you're connected to one to go ahead and download this installer. And then once you're disconnected from your VPN, if you're using one, simply click on the installer and then hit run. Then when prompted for admin, simply go ahead and click yes. Then you'll see this pop up over here. I'll go to advanced options and you can choose where to install it. Then after you've selected another folder, if you want to, simply click install and the download will begin. Then once the launcher opens up completely, simply go ahead and enter your username and password on the account you have a beta key with. You can choose to stay signed in and hit next. Then you'll get a pop-up like such. All you'll have to do is scroll down to the very bottom of this over here and the accept button will become available. After clicking it, you'll see this over here and we'll simply just wait for it to finish. Then simply go ahead and enter a display name over here and I'll click confirm once it's there. And if you haven't already, you'll be asked to reboot your computer. So of course, I'll simply quit and restart my PC to get to play the game. And then after a quicker restart, hopefully things should be working as you'd expect and you should be able to play the game. And there we have it. So thank you all for watching. My name's been Tech Number here for Troubleshoot. Hopefully you found this video helpful and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.